got a small baby in there. That's <laughs> <laughs> a ton. Lot. Lot Definitely got a child in there. You're right. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, how's it going folks? A little change of scenery for you in this video. We are in the Galloway Forest Park and the plan today is we're heading into Tunskeen Boffey for the night and then we're going to go up and do the Corbett behind it in the morning. It's a bit fresh today, you can probably hear the wind in the mic. Well, it's not meant to rain again, but it's looking a bit dodgy. A few spits in there, and those clouds are looking ominous. I'm also out with Mr. Murchie's Mountains, who you may recognise from his own YouTube channel. It's that sort of rain you think I will blow over, but it hasn't. And I'm not bored with the waterproofs and I'm absolutely soaked now. I do have some nice dry clothes to wear in the boffy though, so it's not all bad. This here folks is called the Rockin' Stone and as you can see it's not doing much rocking these days. However, it's a pretty cool feature. Okay folks, we've got about a kilometre to go. I nearly just continued on down that track. But you need to watch here. There's a wee footpath just where Robert is. Well, this boffy is certainly in a windswept part of the southwest of Scotland. There's a bay. Scooby Doo, Scooby Doo. So dinner tonight is salmon and broccoli pasta, and I've got some. What do you call it? I've forgotten. Them. It's gone right in my head. Mashed potato. Right folks, it's 8 o'clock, we have just left the boffy. Sun rises in another 45 minutes, so before we get an early start, we've got some daylight anyway. Met a lovely couple last night, that came in, Ruth and Sean. They sat by around the fire with us, had a few drams and a bit of a chat, so it was all good. Nice boffy night, 
and then Greg popped in as well but he didn't stay, he was just on his bike anyways the plan today is we're going to go for Shark on Minnick and we're aiming for the gap up here, I'll show you in a second and hopefully we'll get up uh, in about an hour's time the terrain below is terrible <laughs> it's just boggy, tussocky, typical Galloway terrain anyway what I'll do is I'll get up this hill a bit let the light come in and I'll bring you back We've been gone an hour now, we're making good progress This is the ridge line here that we're trying to pick up and The summit is just up here somewhere We'll just swivel round You might just be able to make out the boffy there in front of that tree line So aye, we're getting there So this range of hills are also known as the range of the awful hand and apparently they look like a knuckle and uh, when you look at a map you can sort of see the four hulls would represent your your four knuckles and I suppose the Merrick could be the thumb as well but yes, what I'll do is I'm going to plod on get up onto this ridge line and it's a short plod up to the summit ok folks we are about 50, 50 metres off the ridge then maybe another 70 odd metres to the summit so not long now we just heard a massive rumble though so we're a wee bit hope that's no thunder I hope not aye, because it'll be straight off the hill if it is but we'll keep an eye on that Okay folks, there's nothing to hang about up there, it's absolutely Baltic with that wind but from Buffy to Summit that took 1 hour and 50 minutes so that's not too bad so now we're just uh, going to retrace our steps back to the Buffy I'll bring you back then Alright folks, that's me back in Tunskeen Boffy That was a tough descent, but we got down here pretty quickly Now, this Boffy is apparently the birthplace of the NBA Like the spiritual birthplace Because basically what happened, this place fell into a, a state of disrepair And local cyclists and hikers came in, they done it up And from then on, the NBA begun And I think this is back in 1965 So that's a pretty cool story so Robert and I, we were set up here There's space for two and Sean and Ruth, they sort of went on this side here So you can definitely fit four on here But you can see here, there's plenty of room for sleeping on the floor So yeah, it's a great wee boffy This table is new, they just literally brought that in yesterday So that's a nice touch And you've got another table over there And this little stove does a grand job of keeping the place warm but this is a nice touch as well, they've added this rail so you can hang up your stuff to dry there but there you go, just a single room boffy in the Galloway wilds Saw's Law folks we'd have got a view if we're about an hour later typical, never mind it's in the bag Anyways, I'm going to wrap this up. Thanks for watching this far. Remember and check out Robert's channel as well. Otherwise, I'll catch you next one. Cheers.